the true nature in school of God inspired academic achievers. Quago National Colleges is a private higher educational institution and first public college here in Quago, As we reach another milestone, let's take a glimpse to the colorful pages of its former graduates. primary education in GNC in the year 1977 and I graduated in 1983 and my secondary education I graduated in 1987. I have lots of unforgettable moments in GNC but uh, one thing I love most is when I became an officer in the COCC uh, commonly known as CET and um, and I became an officer as a as a lieutenant colonel adjutant. And so from then on, we became we became famous since we are the uh, the um, highest uh, rank in that uh, in that training. Most probably is you know to never give up. There really are some times when you know times are hard, especially the institution. Uh, alam niyo ba, no, first year of teaching ko, ilan yung mga section namin sa high school. Uh, isang year level, ay tumbas ng isang, isang buong first grade 7 to grade 10 namin. One year level na sila to graduate. So, Ang dami, ang dami kabawasan. So, in, uh, bakit kumonti yung mga enrollees ng school as compared to unang panakang namin? Kasi nga, dumami yung mga barangay high school. Siyempre, libre yun. Nung panahon na yun, hindi pa masyadong marami yung mga barangay high school. Tapos, hindi lang barangay high school yung dumami. Even the private schools, di ba, dumami. At the same time, uh, hindi naging uh, because of the pinatugo problem, if you know of that, uh, naging dahilan din ito kung bakit laging baha sa school. Okay, talagang uh, may magkakaroon kami ng mga memories na talagang as teachers, talagang 
uh, kung hindi kami, kung hindi kami uh, aapak sa baha, kailangan namin umapak sa mga maliliit na mga kalete, in our, in our language, para lang makapunta sa classroom. So, maraming pinagdaanin yung school. So, yun. But it never gave up. That's why we are celebrating. And we, are, we will be celebrating our own happiness. Nung elementary kasi lahat ng teachers na especially yung mga lalaki, very strict. So, yung gupit, yung oras, paano ka manamit, yun siguro yung pinakaparang naging ano sa akin, naging naimpose sa akin. Kaya pag uh, paglaki mo, yun, gusto ko yung gupit ko, yung dinis, ano, yung damit ko, ayos, yung crown ko, yung damay, yung puso na yung crown ko. Yun, parang yun. Tsaka yun yung oras. Takot ako kasi ilan yun yung teacher ko lalaki. Yun, kaya. Mamungurot yun, dito. Hanggang hindi mo matakin yung t-shirt mo, hindi niya bibitawan yung pagkakakulot siya. Uh, laging sinasabi sa amin ng mga, ng mga teachers na mag-aral ng mabuti. Tumatak yun sa puso ko na hindi lahat ng, lahat ng nangyayari mo sa buhay ay puro kasiyahan, puro kalungkutan. But most especially, you have to sacrifice. And so, na, uh, as a professional nurse, I became one. At tumatak yun sa, sa buhay at puso ko na ang pagiging success, that success lies beyond sacrifices. Oh, syempre, more years, okay? And I think, you know what, uh, I, I do believe that GNC can survive another 100 years lalong lalo na kung magbibigyan o magbibigay ng mga alumni ang support ang kailangan niya ngayon. Uh, let's face it, it's, this is another crucial year for the GNC. Diba? College education na magiging ingress sa mga public schools na naman. So, anong, anong nangyayari? Ano ba yung future ng GNC? So, iniisip na lang namin that, you know, we continue to give the quality education that we promise upang sa ganon, kahit na paano, makapag-compete sa libre. Okay? Sabi ko nga, kailangan quality education plus very good service. Oo, oh, syempre naman kasi alma, alma mater ko ito. Kaya nga yung mga anak ko ako na gusto ko dito. Kasi, syempre, lumaka rin naman ako rito. Marami naman hindi naman ako lahat dito. Actually, pagkakyat ko dito, parang kanina, nag-flashback lahat eh. Yung mga memories. Sabi ko nga kanina, yung room namin sa kapila. So, yung mga, yun, inihila namin yun, mga, mga puno na yun. Sarap ba na yun? I wish... The GNC would be uh, successful since uh, would be a university soon since it's uh, proven that many of its students have been successful in every endeavor and chosen a course they take. Faith in God, search for knowledge, and love for country. Guapo National Colleges was formerly known as Guapo National Institute and was founded by the former Paris priest of Guagua, Reverend Father Nicanor M. Banzali, in the year of 1980, to satisfy the institutional needs for his parishioners, especially those who are empty-handed. After many crucial years, Guagua National Institute had faced, way back in January 1, 1946, it has successfully acquired ownership of its present site here in Barrio, in Santa Colomina, and started putting up its building one after the other. Gogo National Colleges has successfully developed competent and deprived individuals. We have seen a lot of GNC professionals, but they are just some product of this institution. Truly, we are not left behind. We wish another 100 years of fruitful and successful endeavors for all the entire GNC community. Please stop, faculty, alumni, and everybody who become part of this family. This is our legacy. Let us always reminisce our past as it is future awards. We are.